Do you have any conversation with anyone that might have included a suggestion or even a joke that you might somehow be included in the trip to America? I never heard that. I never heard it before and I've never heard it since. I got a, I actually did get a message from um, a journalist at the Wall Street Journal uh, maybe three weeks before asking me about it uh, via my office. I knew he would never preach again from that moment. Lovely to be here again. I've, this is not the first time I've been in this church. I don't know. I've been here quite a bit over the years. You had to ask uh, him to step down. Pardon? You had to ask him uh, to yes, step I, down. Yes, I had to fire him, yes. Wow. Who's sick this morning? Anybody not well? All right. I, I'm going to pray for you that God will heal you. We did make, take his credential off him. He never did preach again. And uh, we did oversee and ensure that he was never put in a position to be close to kids. And the little boy back there, two little boys, one bigger than the other. But God's got a purpose for their life. A couple of little kids up there, and a sweet little girl with a white ribbon. And uh, we did oversee and ensure that he was never put in a position to be close to kids. But what a fantastic young fellow he is curly hair, sort of, good looking, and it's not your fault you're good looking, so thank God you are. Who wants to be ugly when you can be good looking? The end result was he never preached, he never ministered, he was never in leadership again.